And finally, on the last day of 2020, the last segment of the last most Buffalo of the year, I thought it might be fun to look back on some of the more fun things we've done here in our most Buffalo story of the day. And you may wonder how I managed to get away with some of the non-sensory that goes on. And um, that is a very good question. Where do you even start? And finally today, <laughs> okay. Can you guys see me? Burn my keister on the swing set. We're gonna snip that real quick and we're gonna give up. I'll just get to the point. My sister gave me this for Christmas. One of the questions I get asked the most is where I come up with my ideas. And the truth is, sometimes I don't even have to come up with ideas because the ridiculous things come straight to me. There's also a highly disturbing video about how to eat a chili dog featuring a woman named Janet who calls herself the queen, who calls herself, who calls herself the, who calls herself the queen of ween. <laughs> Featuring a woman named Janet who calls herself the queen of ween. Few people know how to eat it without making a huge mess. <laughs> Janet, this has gone so wrong. I can't make this stuff up. I'm crying. And last but certainly not least, this print of Chris and Andrew Cuomo sitting at the chicken. What? Uh, some of the other weird stuff though, yeah. Don't know. Yeah, we're in my bathroom to Zoom calls now. Hello? Got it, bit. Did not see that coming. Ah! Sorry, Brad. If 2020 has taught me anything, it's that some humans just want what they want. And no amount of danger or stupidity is gonna keep them from it. Calling men dogs is an insult. To dogs. <laughs> Please, dogs are loyal. Anywho. Sometimes I like to toss a match in the dynamite shack. If I'm reading this correctly, today's case is the season of summer versus the season of fall. Uh, are we ready, counselors? Yeah, we are. Is it hot in here or is it just me? Yes. Okay. I think it's important to remind you once again that we are trying and this content does come to you free of charge. Get me out of here! Thing. I'm glad we did this, honestly. I like to embrace failure with the oh, no. maximum amount of dignity. One thing you can always count on is my relentless pursuit of creating a most Buffalo musical. In the meantime though, the Toronto Blue Jays doing a summer stint in Buffalo gave me an excellent opportunity to crank out this banger. Everybody, you can't go to the ball game. You can't see it at all. Buy your own peanuts and cracker jacks, or just stay home and eat some other snacks. Let me root, root, root for the Blue Jays. If they don't win, I won't know. Cause I'm not there. I'm drinking beers with my cat at home. That's all I got. We do have good fun here on Most Buffalo. Hey, listen, before we go, I want to take a minute to recognize our producer, Michelle Hale, our show editor, Colleen Carroll, and of course, our pal Franco, who you know and love. They are the core of this team. They do far more work than I ever did, and we thank them very much for it. We thank you for watching. Hey, until next year, I'm Kate Welshow for Be Well, Stay Well, and Happy New Year.